Welcome to Royal Zone. Before becoming the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan gained popularity as one of the protagonists of the US TV series Suits. But before we continue if you are new to my channel I encourage you to click the subscription button and turn on the notification bell. But this big break in her acting career came after she spent years auditioning and accepting small roles in Hollywood. Now, acting coach Margie Harbour has opened up about teaching the Duchess before she became a famous actress. Reflecting on working with Meghan before she landed her role as paralegal Rachel Zane in Suits, Ms. Harbour told in style, We never know what people are going to become, do we? Ms. Harbour, who during her five-decade career as an acting coach has worked with Brad Pitt, Sophia Bush and Tidney Haddish among others, went on recalling her time with the now Duchess. She said, I've worked with a lot of people before they've landed a big show, like Mariska Hargate before she landed Law and & Order and Meghan before she was on Suits. Look at her now. It was just before Suits and I was teaching auditioning for film and television, so she was in class for that. She was a really nice person, who was a really good actress and I just helped her create, but didn't know what she would become later in life. Meghan debuted on the small screen in 1995, when she played a small part in the TV show her father was working on as lighting director titled Married with Children. Over the years, she made several appearances in successful TV shows such as CSI, NY and Fringe. She also worked as a briefcase model in 34 episodes of the game show Deal or No Deal between 2006 and 2007. Six years later, the Duchess recalled her experience on the show during an interview with Esquire. Meghan said, I would put, deal or no deal, in the category of things I was doing while I was auditioning to try to make ends meet. I went from working in the US Embassy in Argentina to ending up on deal. It's run the gamut. Definitely working on deal or no deal was a learning experience, and it helped me to understand what I would rather be doing. Meghan joined Suits filmed in Toronto, Canada, in 2011 and remained part of the cast until its seventh season. A two-hour-long season finale aired just weeks before Meghan tied the knot with Prince Harry at St. George's Chapel in May 2018. In her final appearance in the show, the Duchess character got married to Mike Ross, played by Patrick J. Adams, and moved to Seattle to set up her own legal firm. Meghan touched upon giving up acting to move to England and become a full-time working royal in the engagement interview she took part in with the Duke of Sussex in November 2017. She said, I don't see it as giving anything up. I just see it as a change. Now it's time to work with Harry as a team. After joining the royal family, the Duchess tied links with four patronages and focused her attention on charitable work. Meghan and Harry stepped down as full-time working royals at the end of March 2020. While they struck deals with Netflix and Spotify to produce exclusive video and audio content, it is unlikely the Duchess will resume acting. As announced by the audio streaming giant in March, Meghan is to host a podcast series this summer called Archetypes. Moreover, the Sussexes continue to focus their attention on causes close to their heart, including paid parental leave mental health and supporting veterans. Please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates.